Hey folks, Douglas Trevino, Realtor, Maxim Realtors here in Southwest Florida. I want to do um, just a quick little note here, a video note. I'm out at in Cape Coral right now visiting homeowners who have had their Liz pendants or notice of foreclosure filed. Um, very occasionally do I come across one of these properties uh, on a daily basis, uh, or at least on the every other daily basis, uh, where somebody's walked away. And I've mentioned this before too. Um, that there are times where people have walked away now this particular case uh guys this was a um just a bank of jp morgan chase i uh, won't give any specifics but this uh this liz pendens was filed beginning of january against this uh property that i'm sitting in front of right now we're gonna go take a quick peek at um this property has uh been abandoned uh, if you look inside, and I'll show you in a quick minute, all the you know personal belongings have been wiped out and somebody just walked away. According to the history, in terms of the MLS activity, there have been no, there's been no short sale attempt. Uh, this is a perfect property and an easy property short sell. Matter of fact, with this specific um, lender, I've had great success um, with the uh, deficiencies for folks as well. So. Um, I, I'm, I'm a little stunned why they chose to walk away from the house, but personal issues or whatever aside, um, they did. So, unfortunately, I, I would have been able to quickly help them sell this house, potentially wipe away their bad debt, and have them walk away. And now they're, because of a choice they made, they're going to face their foreclosure. So, just wanted to give a quick little walk through here um, of what we see walking up to these properties. Um, essentially, all that would happen is the bank's going to come up. Uh, they're going to send somebody out and they're going to put a tag on your door that says, um, you know, usually says this property was found abandoned or vacated. Uh, they did do that here. They actually threw on a bank lockbox. So they changed the locks and they threw that on. Uh, they put in a case of emergency notice and then they also winterized the property, which is typically what they will do to protect their asset. The bank will want to protect their a asset. Um, sometimes a homeowner will uh come home uh will come home and you know maybe they've been gone for a while and they want to grab a few things and they show up and their door's locked um in essence now they have to call the bank to get access uh it can happen so on occasion i run into situations like this which is a shame because this house is a newer home uh the inside and i don't know if we could see exactly but you know they started to clear a few things out in there um it's a it looks like a spec home no big deal, but it's a, a no-brainer in terms of a rental for any investor, and especially my investor network, we can get this property sold quickly. Um, and again, potentially alleviate the client of their bad debt. Now, because of a choice they decided to walk away, they're unreachable, I don't know where they are, and uh, they are now going to suffer the consequences of their decision. So, please don't be one of these people who, who walks away and then makes a bad decision, because in essence, it's only a bad decision to foreclose. There are other options. Please explore those options. Short sale is the number one solution to a foreclosure. Um, but I did want to share this. Uh, and by the way, I walked around the property. AC is in place. All of the appliance, all the um, mechanisms in the back, this water softener, uh, water treatment system, it's all there. How long will it be there? Who knows? Uh, if it goes into foreclosure and it sits for a while, a lot of things out here in Northeast Cape tend to walk away um, if it's been sitting for a long time. So which means more costs incurred and, and, and all that good stuff. So anyway, just a quick note, if you're in a foreclosure situation, please, 239-410-4460, uh, short sell. It's the number one solution right now to foreclosures here in Southwest Florida. Uh, I can only speak of where I live personally. So uh, give us a call and hopefully we're able to help. Thanks for watching. Take care.